Anniversary month trailer. Hang on. All right, starting. Hey, handler helpers, it's me, Monster, Monster Handler Matt. On behalf of all of the Monster Handlers here at Big Blue Bubble, we would like to extend our profound appreciation and gratitude to you for right, joining us on this Monster exciting 12 month journey month. that has been our up. anniversary year. It's been a busy time in the monster world. New seasonal events and skins. Ultimate Creator Experience Mythicals, Colossal Conundra, Rare Wublins, Finishing Amber Island, Epic Evolutions of the Crucible, Theories on the Call Single, Celestial Section! <gasps> and we've saved some extra special content for the big finale during it's September's so anniversary month in version 4.0, arriving on My app stores next, next week. Morning, right? But before we begin, a few notes. The first thing you'll notice about version 4.0 is that we are using glorious new typefaces for all of our in-game interface and text elements. Oh my gosh. You first got a sneak peek during our mind boggle trailer. We were due for a facelift and we took the opportunity to select fonts that will improve accessibility for players with dyslexia and the overall legibility of in-game text in all of our supported languages. Speaking That's of so languages, cool. you can now change the game language directly from the options menu. Handy, huh? Unfortunately, no matter what language your game is set to, it still won't help Monster Handler Tyson be able to pronounce Stablo Miehuricha. I heard that. Ugh. Okay, okay, now that we've got that stuff out of the way, we can really dig in. Let's okay, hear a special starting. report from Monster Handler Alley, host of the Exploratory Compendium of Monstrology series, on one of the most amazing discoveries in the history of the monster world. On one of my recent exchange visits to the monster world, okay. I somehow gained access to the higher plane and Gold Island, and what I saw while I was there blew my mind. This for the cool. first time, a level 15 epic wobox for one of the natural islands can be placed on Gold Island. Just like other wobox, it will epic revert Wobox. to its powered down box form, but not a box form we've ever seen before. Gold Island to power epic up this entity, Gold you'll have to progressively epic unlock Wobox. each elemental phase in order. Plant, cold, oh air, water, and earth. Oh my God. Epic monsters are extremely hard to come by, so this means that you'll be able to hear its song and witness its stunning transformation soon. As more elemental phases are unlocked, the Epic Robux will add more and more musical parts to the Gold Island song, but it's not the only one. The seasonal jamboree can now be placed from seasonal shanty at level 15 on Gold Island. It was only fitting that this monster get a chance to perform alongside the balloons, confetti, and pageantry of the island's anniversary month seasonal island skin. And that's not all. The brand new Epic Jamboree oh. is available to buy or breed oh for a limited God, time near the so beginning cool. and end of anniversary month. <laughs> As someone who loves to record my adventures in my journals, something I really appreciate about the 4.0 update is that Gold Island is getting a Book of Monsters page. Book or should I say, monsters. pages. Since there are so many monsters available to be placed on Gold Island, it has been divided in sub-pages that track your common, rare, and epic pages. This is Not new. to be outdone, the Gold Island's higher plane counterpart, Amber Island, We'll be following the same book of monster format moving forward. This is awesome. Thanks, Monster Handler Alley. Hey guys, it's me, Monster Handler Charlie, host of Monster Mythos. And on the topic of mythos and myths, what's this I hear about a new mythical monster? New One mythical? that the Handler Helper community helped design? Bah. Oh my god, Firehaven! <laughs> oh my god, the fire haven! Oh my god! It's so cute! The new mythical Bazinga will it's soon so be cute. buzzing on both fire haven and mythical it's island. So per your votes in our Make a Mythical poll, oh this monster makes music using its anatomy, is an insectoid, I know I'm and joins Humbug and Funkray as part of the new drone sect family. Really Not only that, it blends in with its surroundings right and now. is asymmetrical. Now, the go with the flow bazinga is actually very important, not just to the monster world, but to the entire this big blue so bubble cool. multiverse. In that, it do... acts as a pollinator for the world tree's flowers and pollinator. helps create it's a, whole it's a new bee? dimensions. Bro, there you have it. Now adorable. you can stop bugging us about releasing it. Oh my god! Get it? Bugging? That was because terrible. it's a bug. Ah, never mind. What about Bazinga's dream mythical? You might ask. Dream mythical? That's a mystery we're keeping under wraps until the update itself. Up next, Monster oh, Handler on. Ben. 
Oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. I was too busy living my best life, listening to the full version of the DJ Epic Celestial Island remix and the brand new Mythical Island remix, featuring the full composition with all 15 monsters, a year in the making. These will debut on all major streaming platforms later in Anniversary Month. Me? I get to enjoy them now. Why? Because I'm a monster handler, that's why. Oh my God. <laughs> Another music-related point of interest in the mobile version of Update 4.0 is that you can now clear your recording studio recordings on a per-island cool. basis. Before, you could only delete them all at once. Maybe you've made an absolute masterpiece on your plant island. Or whatever that is. But you want a clean slate on your cold island. 4.0 will let you do that. Simply tap on Recording Studio on Cold Island and select Clear, and your Plant Island composition remains untouched. Cool. Music to my ears. My time is up. I Monster Handler so Jen, what you got? Hey Handler Helpers! Monster Handler Jen here to announce an exciting multi-part community challenge for Anniversary Month called Dropping Names. Oh my Over God. the course of anniversary year, you've gotten to know a little more about the backstories of the colossal island spirits that this inhabit awesome. the natural island by we completing can name the colossal the colossals conundrum. Now. However, a mystery endures. What are their names? That's where you come in. Each week, we'll be posting three name options for the natural island colossals, and your votes will help to determine which one will be the official canon name, the power of democracy. The first of these polls will be going live on the game's official birthday on Monday, September 4th. We can't wait to start dropping names. Hello, Wendler Helpers, it's me, Monster Handler Tyson, and wow, we have covered a lot in this kickoff video, and we haven't even talked about the special promotions and offers that will be running all of Anniversary Month, though I still feel like we are forgetting something. Huh, what could it be? Tyson, you're back. The plant colossal just granted me a vision of something amazing. I don't think it's going to be ready for a few Earth months, Island but we have to see it. It was. Snap out of it, man! Snap out of it! Ah, of course, the map. That was the vision oh. I had back in December. We originally planned to reveal a new and improved map during anniversary year. This feature is still in development by our Monster Handler team because we want it to be the very best it can be. But I can share some in progress behind the scenes alpha footage. First of all, I have news. For the first time ever, I can officially reveal that the monster world is not a globe. What? It's a torus. A, a donut. Oh. It's, it's a donut. This unusual planet shape has been theorized as possible in the human world, but has never actually been observed. Notably, the monster world has not always been this shape. This is specifically the post Donna fire era, after the breakup of the prehistoric continent shook the very after foundations Donna of the fire. monster world down to its core. This has been hinted at and planned for a while, from the design of the current carousel to this. Check this out. No, 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 this can't be happening. I had my seasonal shanty decorated exactly how I wanted it. Why? Why? No! Our monster handler cartographers and spirit Huzzah! have worked hard to cartographers and spirit Huzzah! have worked hard to reconcile the existing maps across the years with spirit, this newfound knowledge it. and have come up with a flattened Taurus map that displays the positions of all known islands in the monster oh my God, world. This is so Players will cool. be able to navigate around the hand-drawn map oh and God. explore the connections between the various islands like never before. You can explore the monster world by pinching the zoom, swiping, or oh dragging gosh. the mouse, or you can use the scrolling sidebar to highlight a specific island. When an island is highlighted, important information like beds occupied and a more detailed breakdown of your collection progress Holy in crap, the Book of Monsters is displayed. Awesome. We also plan to include greater visibility for active seasonal events. These features and details are subject to change and review, but we are very excited is, to be able to give you a first so look cool. of the new and improved map menu. There you go, there's your 4.0 kickoff video. We can't wait for you to explore all the new features and monsters in next week's update. And as per usual, we have a few more tricks up our sleeves over the course of September. Thank you so much for joining us on this amazing 11 year adventure to breed, feed, and listen to them sing. We couldn't have done it without you. Happy monstering! <laughs>